Hey guys, and I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak your iPhone, uh, iOS 7. This is my iPhone. I uh, just restored it, and it is currently running iOS 7. And I, well, you can see that. Uh, I think it's iOS 7.0.4. So what you're going to want to need is an iPhone running iOS 7, an adapter plug to connect your iPhone to the computer, and then you're going to want to download from online, just type in on Google, Evasion iOS 7.0.4 download, and then download it that. So, uh, I'll get to, and then you're going to want to find it in your thing, so mine is right here, and then once it downloads and stuff, and then you're going to want to click yes, then right here, it's going to say, connect your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad to begin. So, I'm going to connect mine right now. So, mine is connected right now. So, iOS, well, iPhone 4S, and then, so then, you're going to be able to, let's... The mouse isn't working for some reason. Okay, there we go. So, you're gonna just wanna click jailbreak. Come on. My mouse isn't working. There it goes. So, you're gonna just wanna jailbreak. And then, this will take a few minutes retrieving remote package. So, I'll. You guys can just skip through this part of the video until it's fully jailbroken. And just throw in, it is untethered. So just skip through this part of the video to get to the other part. So it is jailbreaking right now. Sorry, this is taking for so long.
now it says rebooting device, so the device is rebooting as we speak. Just vibrated. So now it says to continue, please unlock your device and tap the new iOS or Evasion 7 icon. So I shall do that. I will unlock and right here I Evasion 7. So now it will whoops it will reboot the device. And then we should wait some more. <sighs> so now the device is rebooting, well, it's starting up once again. Then it says, to continue, please unlock your device. Mine is still rebooting, so once this is done rebooting, I'll start it up again. There, it's done rebooting, so now, oh, never mind. Oh, never mind, it says, done. So the jailbreak is done, so we'll let it, we'll let it reboot. So then, just wait for it. So then, reading kernel. It's reading the kernel. And the reason I'm not skipping through all this is just to show you guys how long this jailbreaking process actually takes. It this is actually one of the faster um jailbreaking I've I've do I have done. So now it's calculating offsets. Now it's going to be a rebuilding soon. <coughs> there we go. So once your device is rebooted. Okay. Oh, waiting for activation. So there it is, Cydia, and you just open it up. Well, once you down, well, once it opens up, preparing file system, Cydia will exit when complete. So we shall wait. iPhone is not activated. Okay. Now on my iPhone, well I, like before I got this, I ordered um, iPod 4th generation uh, screen protectors, uh, they're the anti-glare ones, and then I got this and I didn't want to spend extra money on them, so I got 
the anti glare, but I just cut out a little section up here so this stuff would be open. It doesn't fit all the way, but it fits the screen, so that's all that matters. So now Cydia is fully functional, and then you're going to want to click user or hacker or developer, whichever one you would prefer. And then once it loads, you could go on search unable to load internet. Oh, I don't have network, so but it, once I connect to Wi-Fi, this sh would open up. And then I'll be able to get Cydia tweaks on my iPhone. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um click the like button below, subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Thanks for watching.